I'm Peter Dugan. I'm the host of From the Top, and we are here at Colburn recording a show for NPR. Colburn, of course, is one of the great bastions of music making in the United States, and particularly here on the West Coast. There are so many wonderful initiatives here at the school to bring music education to players of all uh, levels and all ages. And uh, because at From the Top, we are all about highlighting the great young artists of America. Uh, it makes perfect sense to be here. And we're also in the beautiful Zipper Concert Hall, uh, which just has such a fine sound in there. And to be on stage recording music is, I'm having a great day. <laughs> I'm Anna E. Speller. I'm 15 years old. I play the violin and I just finished recording Sigourney Bison by Pablo de Sarasate. Sigourney Bison is also called the Gypsy Air. So there's a lot of the gypsy influence in it. So you have to sound like you're improvising while still have practiced it quite well in the practice room. <laughs> and at the end, there's quite a number of tricky techniques, some left hand pizzicato, some different harmonics. And it's really such an exciting piece to play and also to listen to. Being here and playing, I was a bit nervous, but it's such just an encouraging environment. Peter is such a great pianist. He even gave me some tips in certain places and you know, all the recording can be a bit you know, tense. They just really make you feel at home, which is really special. ability and you know talent and enthusiasm and the hard work that these young people have put in to be able to play at the level they do it's uh, I'm I'm uh, glad to say that I'm at a point in my life where I, I'm mostly almost a hundred percent just like enthusiastic and and not uh, not intimidated by how good they are <laughs> I think if I if this were you know, not too many years ago, I'd be like, you know, intimidated. I mean, they're so, so good. So my name is Joey Cars. Um, I'm 18 years old, I'm a senior. And we just heard uh, Binding Disunity. I wrote this piece about a year ago and it's based on um, architecture. It's really based on like the juxtaposition of these two buildings, like one big, grand, beautiful classical building, the uh, Dresden Opera House, um, as opposed to this like new modern-y kind of like music hall at the uh, Tanglewood New Music Center. I had a lot of time to kind of like adjust the piece and um, and uh, make sure that everything went, you know, as smooth as possible. Um, and from the top is like so great at communicating and they, they put us through like this community engagement and career uh, development course, which was like so cool. And like we got to give um, some of the Colburn uh, Jumpstart kids a lesson. So yeah, it was a great experience. To get a glimpse into what's been going on in the lives of young teenage musicians during this past year is actually quite inspiring. All the young players who we're meeting today at Colburn have all been continuing to hone their craft, make music at home, but also finding ways to play chamber music with their friends or through the school. And so it really gives me hope to see that the music making has not stopped, even though we haven't been consuming it in the ways that we're used to. Uh, the, the playing is still going so strong and the passion is still there and uh, to see the joy that these young musicians are bringing onto the stage today uh, really just gives me hope for the future. The goal is to learn from this piece and to um, improve based on what I've you know, noticed, what I liked about this piece and what I thought went really well and um, take my knowledge from this piece onto the next one. 
I have never had any experience like this before, recording, putting it on a radio, on the interview, so it's so exciting for me.